tonight. We're at the Orange Bowl in Miami, Florida. As a future matchup at the Big East, yes, Syracuse, the Orange Men are in town to take on the number two ranked Hurricanes of the University of Miami. 0 and 2 this season when ranked number one and number two. That's the situation for the Miami Hurricanes. Carlos Huerta, number 27, about to kick it off to the Orangemen to a dual safety. 44, Terry Richardson, a freshman from Fort Lauderdale, and number 45, Kadri Ismail, younger brother of the Rockets. Kick is going to come down to Ismail. One yard deep, he'll return. Will not make it to the 20-yard line. And let's take a look at the offense for the Syracuse Orangemen. It will be Marvin Graves opening at quarterback. Behind him, Wayne Kennan and David Walker. The wide receiver, Shelby Hill and Rob Carpenter. The tight end, Andrew Dees. The offensive front, Dan Erickson. You're probably saying, where's our All-American? Well, he's at guard tonight. McCummings will start, and Flattery moves from center to guard because of the injury to Wisdom. Graves with a very long count, maybe an audible fumble. Miami recovers at the 18-yard line, and it's Hamlet. Anthony Hamlet. 15 scores, 30 possessions from this segment of the field for the Hurricanes. McGuire to the short side at the 10 and very close to a first down. Let's take a look at the starters on offense for the Canes tonight. Craig Erickson out of West Palm Beach opens at quarterback. Behind him, McGuire, who just carried the ball. He's at fullback. The tailback is Wesley Carroll. The wide receivers and all very good ones. Randall Hill and Lamar Thomas. Rob Chudzinski, one of the seniors playing his last home game tonight. Darren Handy is the center. The guards, Luis Cristobal and Claude Jones, and the tackles, Mike Sullivan and Leon Searcy. Those tackles, very good ones. McGuire is going to be pushed back, and he will lose yardage. It will be third down, and the line to make is the nine. McGuire on the draw, hit in the backfield, and he'll be knocked down by Jim Wentworth. Wentworth better against the run. That's the, so far, what Syracuse is trying to do, shut off the runner. 10 of 13 for Carlos Huerta this year, and make it 11 of 14 as he splits it. So Syracuse dodges a touchdown. It will come to Ismail again, this time at the two. Breaks off the tackle. Caught from behind at the 25-yard line for the 4-3. Russell Tackle Maryland and Shane Curry, the defensive tackles. The defensive ends, First Anthony Hamlin, end. who recovered that fumble, and Rusty Medeiros, who caused it. The linebacker in the middle is Michael Barrow. On the outside, Darren Smith and Maurice Crum. Cornerbacks, Roland Smith and Robert Bailey. And the safeties, Charles Farms and Darrell Williams. Running play, this is Kennett, right up the middle. 57, six. Option to the left as a flag goes down to the pitch to Walker. Nice spin move, he's gonna move it out across the 30. De Leon, outside Miami. You'll be seeing Big Dan McGuire's uh, the, yeah. brother, the thrower there. The Think there'll be a few passes in that <laughs> Bring your lunch. This time the fullback and another flag is down as Kennan takes it for the first down. You see the middle linebacker creeping up. Barrows, they come with the option. Graves will have a couple to the 40. Second down and eight. Counter option. Now Graves is going to drop back the throw. Going to go long. He just puts it up very, very high. To Carpenter, it is incomplete at the 15. Robert Bailey, third down. Pressure from the outside. They set the screen to the 45-yard line in Barrow. This is deep for Miami. Williams calls for the fair catch, and he makes it back at the 12-yard line. The Hurricanes and their seniors, as we told you off the top of the telecast, they have never lost a home game in this stadium. Erickson back to throw and first down, but nobody behind him, and it is complete to Carroll. Wesley Carroll right. 
Kevin Mitchell, and we'll call his name a lot tonight, is the nose guard. George Rooks and Frank Conover are the defensive tackles. The linebackers in the middle, two other guys that are extremely active, Glenn Young and Matt Conley. The outside backers, Brian LeBaron and Garland Hawkins. In the secondary, Usman Bari and Dwayne Joseph are the corners. Rob Thompson and Greg Walker are the safeties. Walker normally the starter at cornerback, but at strong safety tonight. Pressure to the outside, and Erickson throws it complete to Wesley Carroll. Breaks by one tackler, and he goes down at the 31. Second down and short for Miami. But they won't do that. McGuire from about an eight-yard set takes it from the top of the eye. Kevin Mitchell makes the stop. McGuire breaks off one tackle, takes it out to the 39. Dan Conley, Alex Johnson, number 21, a senior from Homestead, Florida, comes in as the setback. Pressure up the middle from Mitchell. They throw back the screen. He's got it and gets a block. Hang on. At the 45, at the 40, he is out of bounds at the 37. Conley. Johnson stays in the ballgame. He gained 24 in that last play. Erickson over the middle. Wesley Carroll at the 28. 6.55 left in the opening quarter. Hurricanes 3 to nothing. Play action, great fake. Carroll is open. Nope, Chepzinski hits him, and it's inside the 15. Both receivers were almost side by side. As McGuire comes back in at the fullback spot. Dead ball, Dead ball foul. foul. Ball start. Ball start. Miami. Miami. Still first Still down. First. Three to the left as Carroll is set slot to that side. And Hill is to the short side of the field. And that's the direction they run it. McGuire, nice move at the line of scrimmage. And look for the world as he was a second down at about 12 yards. Erickson, all the time in the world and all the running room in the world. He's going to score. right here. He splits right up the middle and scores the touchdown on the screen. Well, there is the record by Carlos Huerta. 136 consecutive extra points, and he is the new NCAA leader, and that is the reason for the celebration on the field. Let's take a break. Carlos Huerta into the record books. 136 consecutive point afters. I think he got a little pumped up. He sends this one five yards deep, and this smile will not return it. Graves at the closed end of the stadium, and now a flag comes down. And you know what? They're going to call delay of game because the 25-second clock had Delayed run game. out. Syracuse. Graves wanted to pitch. No place to go. Rusty Medeiros. Play to Richardson. No, oh, what a fake, and the throw over the middle is complete. I beg your pardon. And a lot of the, the Miami fans sit. Graves with the option. Tries to turn it up. There's just not a lot there. Mo Crumb, 335, left in this opening quarter. 10 to nothing. Kane's lead. Graves wants the throw. He will be sacked by Hamlin. Dick McPherson's ball club faced with a third down. They need to take it to the Miami 48 to pick up the first. Ball is fumbled by Graves. He makes his own recovery. O'Neal, great coverage kick. Williams all the way back to the eight-yard line. He's going to return it. Needs one block and turns the corner. Out of bounds. Erickson over the middle. Bethel drops it. Leonard Conley, who normally is the backup or equal time with McGuire, was suspended from the team this week. Pass over the middle, incomplete. Same route, and Chudzinski couldn't hold on. So who do you stop? There's four guys. Third down and ten for the Kings. Near sideline, incomplete. Snyder's punt. 
Frisbee backing up all the way to the 13 yard line. What a great open field hit. David Walker in the backfield for the Syracuse Orangemen. Flag comes down as the handoff that goes to the fullback. The zone so far in the running game tonight, and then he got another one. That's three of them so far. Graves pass incomplete. Wayne Kennan. This time it is Walker, and he barely gets back to the line of scrimmage. Look at tonight, not even a yard average. Option to the left, he wants to throw it, does, to, to Carpenter. Carpenter will go down, loses the football, and has been picked up by Miami, Robert Bailey. That's the end of the first quarter. We'll come back and sort it out in a moment. We'll give you another look at why he should be. It was not a fumble. McGuire, the lone setback. Takes it back into the boundary side of the field and still out of speed. Fights for two, now three. Let's go back and look at it. Well, I thought the whistle blew, but look at here. First of all, Russell Maryland hustling down there. Got to give him credit for hustling, and he does rip the ball out. But look, how late. First his knee hits, then his back hits, and then the ball is ripped out. Blitz is coming, pass complete to Carroll. Rob Thompson will drag him down at the five-yard line. First and goal for Miami. McGuire, touchdown. Huerta has the extra point. Now the Keynes on top. Both have graduated already. They're ready. They're in grad school. And a real tribute to college football, those two guys. Huerta's kick will hit the cone, so that's a touchback. And the tailback five yards behind him. Graves back to the line of scrimmage. Graves in the short drop, throws it complete. Carpenter with his fourth reception. Graves has it complete over the middle to Hill. Graves is now five of seven, 79 yards. Option play in the quick pitch. Hit and knocked down at the line of scrimmage. I'm telling you, Terry Richardson. Graves in the play action hit, fumbles the ball. He makes his own recovery as Russell Maryland. Third and 12, blitz from the outside this time, and he's going to have to run for his life, and he's sacked back at the 33-yard line by Hamlet and Russell Maryland. Holding, Holding on Miami, Miami will be assessed in the previous spot. It'll still be third down. In our situation, Syracuse with a third down and two. Graves in a play action wants to throw. Gonna go long for his tight end Andrew Dees in the end zone. It is tipped and almost caught. It goes incomplete. Another booming, booming spiral. O'Neill has done a great job. We didn't see him early in the year. That one's going to bound into the end zone as it hit at the one first. Alex Johnson continues to work in the backfield far more than we have seen him in a while. Erickson, pressure on him. Ball is incomplete. Well, Alex Johnson left. He's telling me that they got two men in motion. Pass thrown to Bethel complete at the 26, and he will be knocked out of bounds. And reverses it out, throws back over the middle to Chet Zinski, and he is out to the 50 yard line. Erickson's pass, that one well overthrown. 
Lamar Thomas has done some good things for him, averaging 19 yards a catch for this offense. Erickson drills it, has it complete to Wesley Carroll at the 40-yard line. They go with the running play. Alex Johnson crosses the 35, and he is down to... Johnson spins off one tackler, but he won't get away from Mitchell. Kevin was standing right there. So they normally play a little more off the ball to protect against the run. That's going to be offsides against the Hurricane. The kid's legs look like they should be on about a 6'10 person. Here comes the blitz, and Craig reads it. He did pick it up. Quick pass, incomplete. Chedzinski, Carlos Huerta. And this is going to be a 53. Let's make it 50. Yeah, it's going to be 53 yards. He's got the distance. Plenty of it. Good heaven. It might have gone 63. McGarry earlier tonight, he set a new NCAA record for consecutive extra points. And now he hits a 53 yarder. Canes by 20. Bottom of the screen, and he gets up in pain. We'll get a report on him in just a second as the kickoff goes into the end zone. Draw play to go with Walker. Takes it out of the 25 to the 26. Try sweep to the right side. He's close to the first down. Put a trolling motor on it and use it uh, bass fishing. Two of five and third down conversions for Syracuse. Walker hit behind the line, but he will fight forward with a good second effort. Gray. Play action. Russell Maryland did not buy the face. Play is whistled down. Dead ball. Dead ball. Delay of game. Syracuse. Still second left. Drop play with Walker. Cuts it up into the middle and close to the 24. Graves. Incomplete as he wanted 84. Chris Gedney, but Russell Maryland would. O'Neill's kick is going to bound untaken inside the 40-yard line. Erickson, short, quick drop on this one. Incomplete Wesley Carroll at the 45. His parents also in attendance tonight. They were introduced before the ball game. Erickson stretches it to the near side. Gets Wesley Carroll this time, and he's out of bounds at the 46. Johnson puts the head down. He'll have the Miami first down. Counter trade, they call it. Alex Johnson to the left side. Breaks it open big and then gets hit big time. Alex Johnson inside the 30, down to the 28. Hider scrimmage, which is the Syracuse 28-yard line. Pass is thrown complete to the near sideline, and they're working this drill to perfection. You tire quickly. It's a great point. Erickson right over the middle. Lamar Thomas, first time that we've seen him handle the ball tonight, and he's down to the 16-yard line, and his clock shows 29 and now 28 seconds. Incomplete. Wanted Thomas again, this time at the 9-yard line. And Kevin Williams, the freshman from Dallas, replaces him at wide receiver. Blitz from Syracuse. They pick it up, throws for the end zone. Williams couldn't get to it. Just slow him down. We'll get rid of the ball. 33-yard attempt by Huerta. And Mr. Automatic knocks it home third time here in the first half that he has converted. 
So with 11 seconds left until halftime, our new score is the Canes 23 and Syracuse nothing. Ismail from the 10. And on the other hand, they're not the type of offensive team that can go back and throw the ball 40 times a ball game. Graves with a draw play to Walker. Has five yards and out close to 10. And that will be the final play of the first half as Crum and Michael Barrow combine in the stop. And Gary, in this first 30 minutes of play from the Orange Bowl, it has been all Miami in every facet of the game. So certainly an impressive performance by Miami here in the first half. Okay, Jerry, thanks so much. Score to halftime. Miami, 23 to nothing. Can't do it. And that's the tip of the Syracuse has found themselves in tonight. A little faster than they want to play. O'Neill's kick is going to go out of bounds in a five-yard penalty. It's a great stat for a running team. Nine of 14. That's way too much for Syracuse to give up. He knocks this one down to the two, and it's Kevin Williams on the return. well short. McGuire to the 46 now the 47 yard line. Erickson going long. Incomplete Thomas at the five. 138 yards now for Erickson. And in fact he's only hit one of his last five. Conley coming on the blitz. And that's the reason that that one was so far overthrown. Miami two of six on third down conversions. And they have converted another one. Lamar Thomas on the receiving end. And a flag comes. Faith man. Against Syracuse. Five yard inverted. Still first down. Second down and short. They need about three and a half. Erickson, Wesley Carroll. That combination has worked all night and it does again. 12.58 left third period. Canes 23 to nothing and driving again. Here's an audible as he looks for the blitz. Short drop and the pass knocked down. That was Usman Bari. He hit, barely spoke English when he came to Syracuse. Maybe only two or three hundred uh, words that he was even had on his vocabulary. That screen will go down to the 22 in that time. Blitz coming from the middle. Pass overthrown. Jeez, and this is a little different weather for him. Huerta tries to make it four for four on the night. He is human. Pushes it to the right. <laughs> so let's take a break. Graves with the draw play, and it goes to 44, Terry Richardson. Off the option, throws the pass overthrown. Carpenter is the man that he wanted. Some place of safety and it's tip. Had his tight end. Offside, Miami. Replay third down. Right, Kennan has. Nope, he's not going to have the first down. That's going to only be about a yard, maybe a yard and a half. Syracuse tonight. Williams runs away from it and that ball if it had not been tipped by the Syracuse player would have hit a Miami player at the third. Play action pressure up the middle and it is almost intercepted at the 34. They go 
with the running play and Alex Johnson gets grabbed by the back of the shoulder. We need a stop here. Miami is three of eight on third down conversions. Blitz from Conley and the ball is caught by Chudzinski. Rob Thompson will make the tackle at the 46 yard line. You give it away, he'll audible. So he came from the secondary and they got it. Here the contact in the middle as LeBaron came up. That's right. Can't win that way. Erickson's pass overthrown. Wesley Carroll is the man that he wanted. Had it bruised back in the first half. But it would take a lot of things to keep him off the field. This one complete to him. First catch of the night, and he's inside the 30. That'll move the chains again. Where are the linebackers taking it away? Go to the next guy. Johnson, good move to the outside, and almost turns the corner. Hit in the backfield, and Lasardi, who just came into the ball game. 25 second clock down to one, and they got it off. Pass is caught by Wesley Carroll, and he's out of bounds at the 15-yard line. First down Miami from the 15. Tenth play of the drive. Alex Johnson breaks off one tackler, and he'll take it down to the 12. This Kevin Mitchell is... the 10 and Johnson and he's getting a little fatigued at Kings lead it 23 to nothing. Play action to Johnson wants Carroll in the end zone and that one's overthrown. Well I, I haven't seen many who do and, and that's not any indictment against Craig. I mean that's the, just the way the game is nowadays. If you can pressure the quarterback you can slow him down. Just a 26 yard attempt and he's got this one. Carlos Huerta, now four of five of the night. Their new score, Hurricanes, 26 to nothing. Yeah, I think you're right. It, and it'll be interesting to see on this series if they do go ahead and say, okay, we're going to change our philosophy. Kadria Smile, one yard deep. Oh, tried to take it back to the inside. Looked as though he had an avenue up the side of the field. And I had sent some information in to the coaches here at Miami. And I made several phone calls on my own. And of course, uh, one of the coaches came up. Okay, thanks so much. Doctor, all I can tell you is if he had gone to Notre Dame and been matched with Zorich, that would have been X rated on defense. <laughs> Fumble is recovered, and he should be. Exemplary on and off the field. Third down. Graves better hurry. Loken for it, and he is going to be tackled at the 22 by Michael Barrow. My spiral is not going to turn over, and Williams will not have a chance to return it. And that one is taking a Miami bounce as the flag is thrown. At the Change the tempo of this game. Flipping against Miami during the kick, being forced from the post scrimmage kick spot where the kick ended. First down, Miami. Here at the Orange Bowl, 26 to nothing. Our score with 1:41 left in the third quarter. Erickson, ball is tipped. And behind this face. Okay, Washington and Iowa in the Rose Bowl. Erickson dragged down for behind. It's George Rooks. They haven't put it in the end zone this half. They're fighting hard. On third down and long, Erickson sets the screen and he's got Johnson. 35 out to the 41 yard line and it will be short a single safety and Syracuse looks as though they're coming after it. Nope they got the return on. Prisby with the fair catch signal and he makes it at the 16. He'll throw on first down zings it out there has it complete that ball was almost intercepted. Carbon is still in the ball game. But we have an advanced in production on March. Should he come into play? <laughs> play action by Graves. 
has it complete to Hill. And he's down to the 45. Miami picks it up and returns it. 10 points on two turnovers. Drop play. 44, Richardson. And he'll take it down to the 41-yard line. Draw play. Richardson. Nope. <laughs> Great fake again by Richardson. Now they're going to throw it to him. Catches it, still on his feet, and is knocked out of bounds. That's Barrow. The ball and runs through the line of scrimmage Holy like that. Derek, you repeat second down. Second and 15, the ball at midfield. First time we've seen the Bear defense tonight, and Marvin's checking off. And he's going to go long for Carpenter, and it is... Knocked away, and that's a really fine defensive play by Robert Bailey. Line to pick up is the Miami 35. Marvin going to have to find some place, and he does. Goes to Richardson. Fourth down, Syracuse will go for it. Option pitch. Richardson hurdles the man, and he is not going to have it. Robert Bailey. An assistant athletic director in charge of academics, and before the game tonight, they recognized all the seniors here and allowed them to take a parent or some significant other onto the field. The early, late 70s, early 80s, a 24% graduation rate for the athletes here. This year, 17 of 17. 100% will graduate from the University of Miami. Ron? All righty. Wesley Carroll has that completed pass, and he's across midfield. Erickson has this complete to Hill. Gets to the outside. Now he wants to come back to the middle. And Tim Brando has an update. Shannon Crowell on the carry. Then they have the cotton bull. Erickson drills the pass complete at the 20. Lamar Thomas was there. With the five people in there, Miami is. Crowell down to the 10 yard line. 5'11, 200 pounds. Drop play to him, gets outside. At the 5, and he's down to the 3. Wayne Joseph made the hit on it. 8 20 left to play in the ball game. Crowell, boy, does he get melted at the line of scrimmage. Glenn Young. Third down Miami. They have made four conversions in a row in third down. No one's covering Wesley Carroll. There he is. Go to and he scores. But there was enough fans <laughs> fluttering there. He could catch anyone he wanted to. Huerta with the extra point. And the Canes on top big. 727 left to play in this one. 33 to nothing. And Huerta kicks that one out of bounds. So Adria a smile from the eight. That is great coverage for the special teams at Miami. It started every game. Offsides called on this one, so he's going to do it again. He's getting a lot of work. This time for the 25, and it's his smile again. Ismail runs into his own man, and he brings it out close to midfield. Marvin Graves. Boy, does he get belted. Pass is thrown complete. Russell Maryland runs right by the quarterback. Pass is thrown complete to Walker. Wow, what a hit at the 20. That's Daryl Williams. Option play, Graves will keep it. And not for very far. Option to the other side as the pitch comes to Walker. Waits for his block, and he's going to make it to the 13-yard line. Walker, eight carries for 36 yards. Option 
pitch comes to Walker turns it inside it is first and goal Syracuse at the four. Touchdown Graves. Extra point attempt is up and good. So 352 left in the ball game at a Hurricanes 33 at Syracuse 7. I mean, look how he has the ball yeah. on the tee as well. It's almost going to make it go over uh, end over end. And it's going to be recovered by Miami at the 41 yard line. Forgive give him the benefit of the doubt a little bit for a while. 259 yards so far for Craig. This is Alex Johnson. He gets tripped up at the line of scrimmage. What? We're going to see his season numbers. We're going to get a look at a good football game next week, too. Again, I'll tell you. Right, Florida, to Florida State. Yep. <laughs> Toretto's pass incomplete. That we're beginning at 4 Eastern time. Toretta has it complete. Darrell Spencer, the sophomore from Merritt Island. Game they could lose. I mean, Notre Dame's a good football team with a healthy rocket. Notre Dame could lose tonight. <laughs> Running play will go for Shannon very short Crowell. yardage. That's Shannon Crowell. <laughs> Against the Hurricanes ball, coming up. Ball, ball start, start. Miami. Miami. Still second down. Toretta goes with a running play. Jim Wentworth will step up and make the tackle. I'll sign autographs during the game. Pass is caught at the 30. And still on his feet to the 20-yard line is Bobby Bird. That's good for 25 yards. I went in the locker room and talked to him. I said, hang it up. Keep your head up. He's going to come back to you. You're going to get another chance. And he's made the most of it. 33 to 7. Kane's on top. Crowell again weaves his way for a couple now three. The number two ranked Miami Hurricanes win and win convincingly over the Syracuse Orangemen 33 to 7 at the Orange Bowl tonight. So we're going to take a break. We'll come back and wrap this one up in just a moment.